for lots of families, Messy Church is a place where they can be together and explore faith in a creative and really relaxed environment. It's very popular and we run it once a month. We have people amongst us who are grandparents and we have eight week old babies here and everybody in the middle. It's wonderful to see. There's a grandpa who came just to, to, to welcome at the door and he's coming up the craft and he's sat there leading the craft and he's wonderful, the kids, you know? Um, and then the community mums, they're the ones who are um, getting alongside supporting and when I said I needed food, the community mums are the ones bringing the food in. They're really getting involved, it's so good, it's so good. It's breaking down barriers that separate church from community and bringing and overlapping the church is really cool. Yeah. We believe that our church needs to communicate more effectively with the local population and um, this is one of the best ways to do it. We found that Messy Church has really helped us get to know families in our community. They, they come in and they get a warm welcome here and we're not, we're not Bible bashing folks. We welcome them, we sit next to them, we play games, we do crafts. We're just ourselves next to folk in our community. We've seen growth in numbers and we've seen growth in people relating to each other. As a team, when we meet to plan our Messy Church session, we have a look at the Messy Church material and we have a look at the, the scripture and we focus in on what the scripture is about and we almost have our own devotional time together before we then decide on how we're going to bring this to the families in Messy Church. The church bit is really important. Each Messy Church takes a biblical theme or a Bible story and every single one of the activities is carefully thought through so that the person leading that activity can share something of the life of God with the children and the adults who are participating in it. And over the years, Messy Church has grown in its different expressions. So now we find there's material to help us with Messy Baptisms and Messy Communions. There has even been a Messy Church wedding.